What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys part 2 for my playthrough on Super Mario 3D World for the Nintendo Switch. So guys, in the last episode, we got started with this game 100% at World 1, and in today's video, we're going to be trying to complete World 2. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys so much for the support that has been going out across the channel and the two brand new playthroughs. But we're getting started here in 2-1, and as you guys can tell, we changed our character. We got Luigi today, so his little ability is to actually jump higher than uh, most characters or every character he has the highest jump look how high he jumps ready really? look at that dude you get some major air so you can actually get up to higher spaces and all that good stuff and get things better but we're chilling here so if you guys are looking to get top of the flagpole the best character to probably use is luigi for it so if you're struggling on some lighter or uh, uh levels to get top of the flagpole bring out luigi get one with that or peach works pretty well too but we're getting off to a solid start we got these new characters right here and we're in the sand area we got those little uh well, I don't even know what they're called. Little dodo birds? I don't even know. They're hilarious, though. But if you climb up here, I remember this so well. You get ourselves a little nice gold pipe right here. You guys know, know what gold pipe does? You have to guess it. It's probably coins. Look at this. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> you can just jump across and get a bunch of coins. And there should be a hidden Luigi, like, inside the coins. You guys, like, keep it a close eye on it. I'm kind of looking for one. I did not see one. I did not see one. But that's all it is. It's just extra coins. It's not like you get a stamp or anything. It's pretty nice. Now we get one here. You get a few extra one ups, but like I showed in the last episode, you can get unlimited one ups in 1 2. Come here, boy. Ball that boy up. And now we can actually get all these coins. And what the red coins actually do is every time you get all eight, you just get a power. Pretty simple. Pretty simple. Nothing too special. And hopefully, we did not pass any any green stars. So we're just stand. Gotta find them. Uh, is there something back on the street? Okay, so you got this fairy right here. Can I see anything? I see the stamp over there, so that's good to know. Is there another green star anywhere? I'm trying to look for another green star, because we still have two more to collect. There's a stamp. Is there, like, a pipe up there? I think there's something up there. Do I see a little timer? But, yeah. Let's get, let's get back into this. Is there anything over here? I will backtrack. I will backtrack to get all the green stars, because that is what we're doing for this playthrough. We're 100% in it, so no ands, it's a butts with the green stars. What I got here... Oh, that's what I wanted. Let's go. Come here, boy. Built. <laughs> I love having this invincibility start. And just being... Oh! Oh, my God. I'm so good at this game. Oh, oh my Lord. How did I... <laughs> Yo, how did I survive there? That was actually pretty nuts. I was just sitting there. I was like, oh! Look, I had the cat suit. I was able to climb up there. I believe there's a green star in one of these, right? I have to get him to stab one of these. Where's it at? Is it, is it in this one? I know sometimes, yeah, there it is. I was gonna say, I know sometimes they have uh, green stars and stuff. I believe you can come over here, head into the sand, and hop up here. Yeah, dude. Oh my god, I miss this game so much. So much fun. What we got here? And then the limited block. Smash that up. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir, yo. We got the little coin block. I remember this was introduced in uh, Super Mario Brothers 2. Let's go over here. I think I just gotta come over here and save Toad. You only give me one or something? Let's see, let's talk to Toad now. Toad, what's goody? My dude! <laughs> My dude! Save Captain Toad, he gives you a nice little green star. And then the stamp's super easy for this place to just chill in there. But we gotta run this way. Actually beat this out. We gotta get top of the flagpole. Can I just jump? There we go. Just jump, get top of the flagpole. And there we go. 2-1 is completed. But yeah, hopefully I can uh, defeat this whole world one in a decent amount of time. Because I really don't want episodes to go longer than 30 minutes. Like, I don't mind if they go a little bit over 30 minutes. But I don't want to push in like an hour. I really don't want that. So if I see or if I notice that it's going to go longer, I will stop it probably at like the halfway mark and split the worlds up into two. But first world, we were able to crush out the park in less in about 30 minutes. So I was just like, yeah, we might as well finish this up. But we got a couple extra levels here. Ooh, a little Bowser statue there. What's that do again? I think I think it just you just need green stars to unlock things. You can use Amiibo during your adventure. Oh, what? Do I have Amiibo? I do love me some Amiibo. <laughs> but if you come over here, there's little circuses sometimes or little circus tents in each world. And it's legit just a free stamp. You just walk in there and grab a stamp. Just adds to your collection. Get a nice little pixie. Fairy pixie. Whatever you want to call it. <laughs> but I believe, if you guys haven't checked out the Bowser's Fairy playthrough, go for it. Because I'm going to talk, talk about it. But I believe the Bowser's Fairy is only like... So it only take me like five episodes now. But I've seen people do it in like six. But if I'm 100% in it, maybe, maybe it will take up to 10. Like I said, 10 at least. But this will, this will take me a little bit longer. We got this place right here. I know I can pick you boys up, can I? Yeah. Oh, and I can just bite stuff. Is that green star? It is. Okay, nice. So easy green star right off the rip. 
We'll head this way. We'll hold these guys because they can eat these little buzzy beetles right here. Get them! So you, just, you just basically carry a piranha plant all day here. They can just walk around and bop, bop, bop. <laughs> Yo, that's so sick. I really do like that power up. Hey, yo, chill on me. Chill on me. Eat you up. And we should be able to jump here. And jump here. Bang. Give yourself this. And. Did we miss a green star? I have to. I'd feel we did. But hopefully we didn't. On my cat suit, I'm gonna pick up you. Like a munch on these buzzy beetles. There is a cat suit that I do not need. Anything up here? Nope. Where's a stamp? How do I get down there? Can I walk through here? No. How do I get to the stamp? You cannot bite him? Yo, what are you doing? I just killed him. How do I get to that stamp? What is this? What is this? I'm bringing out my cat suit. Maybe, can we call through the walls? Oh, we can. Okay, cool, cool. I think I did bring out the cat suit. So that was a stamp, and, so we, and we still need two more greens. Hopefully, I find one soon. Uh, I believe we're chilling. But I believe we just grabbed this thing. We should be able to eat all these guys. Eat them up! Yeah, and unlock a nice little secret path. Can I just walk in there now? There we go. Walk in here, and the second green star should be right in here. We gotta hit this, and what's this do? Unlocks the stairs under, and then I gotta walk through. There we go. Perfect. Give me that green star. That was lucky number two. So we are on the right path. We're chilling here. I should actually pick up that dude again. Oh no, I'm dead. Oh no. Oh no. Oh! I'm too good at this game. I'm too good! Uh, there's a door, but there is also a path back here. And we got Toad scared of Bowser versus Cardboard Box. Break that, and I believe it gives us a third and final. Captain Toad's just sauce on the green stars for us today. <laughs> Give me that, boy. Take that, and we can get grooving. Beautiful, so 1 2, basically done. Oh, I don't even need to go up there. I could just cat suit it up. Climb it, top of the flagpole, boy. Dude, this game is so much fun. It really is. They should have added an online mode to this with good connection because Super Mario Maker 2's online mode was an awesome idea. Just the connection was awful. Everyone was lagging every single time. And I didn't even get a chance to enjoy it. But they should add an online mode where you can race people or play with people in a co-op mode online to get the crowns. I think that'd be so much fun. Like, say you have two separate games. One's for co-op mode only. And then the other one is for just a solo player. That would be so much fun. That would legit be so much fun. Yes, I know you can snap shot. What is this, like an extra place? This should be 1-2 because for some reason 1- or 2-3 came before 2-2. But let's head over here. Bang, hop in here. And yeah, I'm thinking we should be able to uh, finish this up. Finish up World 2. We got Pud Pod... Pud Prod Peaks? Uh, how do I do this? Oh, I can do this. That's how we do it. So there's some motion controls in this. That's pretty dope. I can hit that. Bang. Yeah. I remember uh, using the. Did I use a gamepad for this? I feel like I did use the gamepad for this. Okay, let's get up here. Uh, the the old Wii U gamepad. Oh no, my cat suit! What you mean? Can I jump on this, Galumpa? I'm out of here. Uh, let me get this. Got a little bit of motion controls going here. On here, get a cat suit or something. Anything under them? I feel like I should drop down there. I'm gonna do it. Is there anything down here? Oh, there was. Let's go. Let's go. I just had a feeling. I, did, I, I totally forgot about it. But there we go. Stamps right here. See what I'm talking about? Some stamps are, and uh, green stars start to get harder. Like, that one's pretty hard. Luckily, I was just like, ah, screw it. I'll check it. I'll risk my life. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm going to bring out this thing now. Go there. There. And just create yourself a staircase. And then go back the other way. Bang, bang. And hit this one. This one. Oh, there's a green star up here. If I get that. You can just wall hop, can I? Cool. There we go, wall hop there. Before these things close off, you just make your way there. And that was the first one, so we are thriving. We're in a good position here. Get yourself a little checkpoint. But I remember when I would play with my friends or my brother, I would always race for a checkpoint or make sure I get the green stars, because that's how you get the crown. That's how you get the most points possible. You just go for green star stamps and, and uh, fly. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> and you just go for a uh, flagpole or like checkpoint. But bro, luckily we did get that checkpoint. Now I don't have my cat suit! We still got a green star, and with, that was our first death. That was our first death for this playthrough. Rest easy. Rest easy. Let's keep it to one. Let's keep it to one. But now, you know, the path just moved, and I missed it like that. But I ended up jumping again that one. There's a cloud, so whenever you see a cloud... Oh, my God. I'm still puffing. Yo, Goompas, get away from me. But whenever you see a cloud, you know that there's like a green star there. Or a stamp. You just head to the cloud and defeat whatever it has to offer. Head over to this one, and then onward this way. But the final world in this place is actually really hard. It's actually really hard. They got some awesome levels, which I, I'm so glad they made it challenging. We can grab our uh, invincibility star and run this way. And I believe we don't have to kill all the enemies. I think we just gotta make it to the end. 
when we get, uh, green star, yeah. Bang, bang, bang. But if you kill all the enemies, you get yourself to one up. Second green star, check that off. Good moment. Can, you, can I get a power up? Give me a power up. Let me give me a power up. All I want is a power up. Give me some. There we go. Let's like, so fire, fire. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. I think we're at the end here. We're pretty close to it. No, we're not. Okay, I see the green star, though. Okay, we'll hop down here. There we go. Get ourselves that green star. And then get my motion controls back to hit this. And hop up here. And then same thing with this one. Alright, beautiful. Eat me. Eat me. Eat me. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. So this place 100%. It just need that top of the five goal. And we do not have cat suit, so we do gotta watch out for that. We go this way. Is that the flagpole? That is the flagpole. Just take our time here. I should be able to get this. We just got that high jump. Give me that. Let's go. Let's go. So once you get in like the vicinity of that top gold thing, it has a little magnetic pull. But if you're just around it, it will just suck you into it, which is awesome. So you don't have to hit it like dead perfect every single time. But again, like I said, if you need top of the five poles, because sometimes you you just playing through it. And if I miss top of the five pole, I probably won't go back. Actually, maybe in a play in in this playthrough, I would I would go back. Like, when I played normally, if I missed top of five pole, I would complete all levels, go back and do them one by one for 100%. But there we go, first three levels down, and we unlocked No, I didn't want to go back in here. I want to go to the pipe. Can I, uh, exit out of this? No, I cannot. That's whack. Um, there we go. No, now try again. Exit course. There we go. Get him out of here. I'm not doing that again. I already beat it. But let's see how many courses there are. Can I check on the map or something like that? This is really, okay. I think we should be fine with this. I think we should be fine with this. What's down this pipe? That's my question. A toad house that I really don't need. I'm just gonna head back. So keep that in mind if I ever need power ups or something. I'm gonna go back there. That toad house is unlocked. Okay. Now we can move on this way. And we got. Ooh, this one. Oh, we got that. Oh, we got like the magic house. Yo, I cannot wait to show that off. I cannot wait to show that off. There's so much fun. They're little mini games to get green stars. And if you lose one, you start from the beginning. But oh, this reminds me of like a, a World 1 level. Dude. Yo, I love this atmosphere right here. Get that. Looking for my stamps and stuff and things. Cat Bell's back in action, baby. We got green, green cat Luigi. Oh, we need Mario? You guys already no deal. We're gonna hit exit course. I'm gonna go get Mario. I'm gonna go get, go get Mario. So there's things like that. Don't worry, I'll switch back to Luigi after this. But there is things like that where only certain characters can hit certain switches. So, in this level, we're going to be playing as Mario because I believe that's a stamp there. Where's Mario? I think it's a stamp. I think you get a stamp from there. Give me that. This. And we got one here. Let me go check it out. Mario, what do we got? Yep, we got a stamp. So, I would not be able to 100% this without Mario. But this, we got that. And I'm going to head over towards this way. Got these coins. Head down here. I want that cat suit, though. Cat suit rocking out. Bang, yo. Cat suit's so good. I absolutely love it. Definitely one of my favorite power ups in Mario games. What we got over here? Just coins? Anything this way? No. Alright, see the one over here. And look for those green stars. We can get up on these walls, right? Can you? We got the sand. Is there anything up here? That's my question. Ooh. Where's that green star at, though? Where's my green stars at? Is it up here? I feel like, I feel like we need a green star soon. Where you at, buddy? But I guess once we get the first one, we'll know. Where's my first green star at? I'm looking for it, man. Gotta be around here, right? There's a uh, checkpoint. I don't want to head into a new area and then have to backtrack. Here, what we got here? Got another cat suit? No, we do not. I feel like it's around here, and I feel like I'm missing it. Let me climb up here, see if there's anything up here. They do give us cat suit. I'm gonna backtrack a little bit. Because I feel like if we go down that pipe. Yo, look at all this little goopas, man. I feel like if we do backtrack, we are missing it. I'm just gonna keep looking around here. I think I can run through here. Yeah, I'm cooking, man. All these enemies want to smoke. Uh, is it under here? I don't want to. Okay, pretty cool. Uh, hey! Back here? I'm just gonna do a like, speedrun thing, but nah, I think we'll actually hold up. No, it's not here. Okay, let's just go back. Let's keep moving. I guess there's not a green star here. So, again, I, do, I don't want to go into the pipe and just get smoked. Meaning by that, like, I don't want to go into the pipe and have no way out. Because I believe once you go into the pipe, you can't get back out. Let's see. This pipe, yeah, we can't get back out. So we have to hope this, the first green star is down here. And if not, we're going to have to backtrack here. 
I believe actually can I go this way? I think I can go this way. No, I cannot. Over here. There's an extra cat bell, but I'll keep that. Um, I go this way. What's down here? There's a pipe. Alright, so we're gonna grab this pipe. See what's in this pipe. Maybe the first green star? I want it to be the first green star. That timer. I believe we just have to Oh no. I believe we just have to light up all these uh buttons here. I'll pick up a baseball too. <laughs> Just yeet it. Did I get it? Please be lucky number one. Dun, 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 dun. It's two! No! I know exactly where the first one's at. We'll backtrack for that one. We'll backtrack for that one. Actually, let's just do try again. We just land. Oh, is it, where's this one? That's three! We're trying again. I'm going back. I'm, I'm telling you, we're 100% in this playthrough, so... I'm hitting try again. I think it's back here, isn't it? No, it's not. Where is it? What is this? What's right here? Where? I know this first one's hanging around somewhere over here. Is it? Uh, it might be up here. Might need a cat suit to get up. It's up there. It is up there. There's no doubt. Anymore. Let's go get this thing. Let's go get it. Now I know where everything's at. They, I told you guys, once we start getting into uh, later worlds, I'm going to start forgetting where all the all the, uh, all the green stars and stuff is. We got the stamp. I'm going to climb up here. I hope I didn't check this spot. And there's the first one. Okay, beautiful. Now we can head over here. And now we can basically just speed run this now that I know where everything's at. Get on our high horse, baby. But I got to remember to switch back to Luigi after this. But that's the best how you can climb up walls. Like, that is such a good idea. Bring Cat Mario in here. Come on, your rocks. Just be able to do this. Do a long dive. Bop. Snipe on him. And take this path. I'll be able to just run under here because I'm a cat. Go through this pipe. Come here. Come here. Hop down here. And then all we gotta do is light up all these things again. There you go. Light them all up. I'm trying to think like what this game reminds me of. Not this game. This little mini thing to, to light up all these panels. I don't know. It just reminds me of something. Like maybe something out of Club Penguin. You guys ever played Club Penguin? You guys, you guys had a childhood. Club Penguin rocks. <laughs> I absolutely love that game. I used to play it all the time as a kid. I used to spend hours on the computer collecting points, collecting all the stamps and everything. We can head this way, grab the third and final green star, go through this pipe, and actually start finishing up this level. But we only been moving for like 30 some seconds. Oh no, we got another 100 thing on the clock. I was gonna say, that'd, that'd be insane. I'm gonna take the right way for this one. Give me this. Top of the flagpole, baby. Top of the flagpole. That was level four. We do have like a little magic house, which I which I'm hyped for. I actually am very excited for because I really do like them. And at the final world, they have a magic house with 30 green stars in it, and you have to complete all 30 of them without messing up. I remember it took me a little bit. It took me a, actually like a couple days to do. The final level took me a couple days again. Granted, I was like 12, but like <laughs> that was like 12, 13. But it, I remember it like it was yesterday. Like that's why it was so satisfying to beat because it took me so long. But, oh, what do we get? Slots! <laughs> Yo, you guys know I love the slots. But we'll do them in a little bit. All right, now we got to switch back to Luigi. But we're going to go in here. It's a mystery house. And give me Luigi, baby. Mystery house melee. Back to Luigi because I want to show him off. And next episode, I think we're going to do Toad. And then we'll say Peach for last. I already know what these things are. So five green stars. And we just got to complete all five missions. This one should be pretty simple. This is the first one, so it's kind of just showing off everything. There's the first one. And you have 10 seconds to defeat the, the mini thing and get the green star. I just want to hop on you. Oh, are you kidding me? Now I don't have a power-up? It's going to be such a pain. Give me that green star. Now I don't have a power-up. E. Let's go, baby. Get it. What's the next one? Cat Koompas. Jump on both of them. Oh, that was a light work. And I get a cat suit. Give me that thing before we move. Cat suit back, and we're done the third one. Got these guys. How come I can't call these guys? Oh my lord, we're gonna, we're gonna lose. No, can I kill him? Give me that, give me that, give me it! Oh my god, on the one second mark. Last one, I don't have power up though. I want one. Fire bros, there's one down. Kill me. Come here. Hang two down, and there we go. Mystery house is done. So they get harder and harder as each world goes on and more green stars will pop up. Like say I was at the fifth one and I lost, I would have to start all the way back at B. Which is pretty cool. I actually really do like that concept. Sir, and that should be 100% because there's no stamps there. It should just pop up. 100% flag, yeah. We got 100% flag there. And what is this? A mini boss level? I'm with it. Who wants smoke? 
Big Galoompa blockade. <laughs> I love Galoompas, man. Oh, these things are enormous. Can I just like hit them off? Hey, yo, get him out of here. Just giant Galoompas that you just jump on twice. <laughs> Nothing too special. Come here, boy. Built. Get him out of here. Done, GG. Give me my coins. Give me my green star. And we out of here. Beautiful. I believe there's a, like, I don't know what the total amount of green stars are. There are a lot. There are a lot. Say there's 80 levels, so then just multiply by three. There might be 80 levels. It might be 80 levels and 240 green stars. Or a little bit more than that. Oh. It's something around there. It's pretty cool. There is a lot to do in this game, which I absolutely love. Take out the blockade, and we unlock this level. And are we almost done? Oh, we get the cherry power up. <gasps> Ooh, I love the cherry power up. But I think we're almost done here. Yeah, we have two more levels. Let's go. We crushed it. We're going to be able to finish up World 2, no problem. So maybe we won't have to split up worlds until the later ones, because I know some of them get bigger, but World 2 will be able to finish just in today's video. Oh, this is a jam. Hey, hey, hey. Yo, we got this new power-up, too. We got the cherry power-up, which duplicates us. Now we have multiple people. And the concept for this place is to actually, like, stock up on your cherries, because you're going to need multiple, uh... Multiple people to do uh, to get everything. Oh, now this is the best part. Now we both throw fireballs, though. No! I really lose my boy? I'm starting over. I'm starting over. I'm not messing around here because I know I'm going to need him at the end. So it's fine to start over. And we get to listen to the jam again. And if you ever do get separated from the, the group, you just go into a corner and you'll all meet up here. Get him, get him out of here, double fireball. And when you get up to like five people, because you can't get as many as you collect, you'll legit just have like a, a, like a storm of fireballs. Get him out of here. There's another cherry, let's go. <laughs> Look at us all, no! Why are we getting separated from the group? Come here, everybody in the corner. Let's hop down here now, sit here. Another fire fire that we can save. Everyone should just follow me. Everyone in the pipe. I forget which one we control. We, we, we control them all. It's weird. It's a weird controlling mechanic, but it's, it's a lot of fun. Fireballs, fireballs, fireballs. Get him out of here, yo. Get back in the corner. Yo, come on, boys. Hey! Chill on me. Chill on me. <laughs> yo, oh, yo, these dudes are coming for us. I'll do my wall bounce shots. There we go. Get him out of here. Now we're cruising. This is why you need multiple of them, though. Just split here and you get the double path. And you get there. Cool. And then I think at the end you're gonna need a lot more. I could. Can I just throw like fireballs up here? Got more of these. Oh no, where are you going? We need more cherries. We got another cherry. They're coming up. Everybody up here. Yes, sir. Four Luigi's. <laughs> Yo, that's hilarious. And we got all these guys. I'm gonna start sniping them. There's another cherry there, though. Kill them all. Give me my fifth one. Five of these boys. Yo, <laughs> look at my army, dude. What's over here? Another cherry? Oh, how do we get up there? We have to get up there. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I know how to get up there. I'm gonna wait for that to actually drop down. Do I get another chance at this? I do. So go here. Send the one Luigi up there. And there was a Sam. Okay, that's pretty cool. And now we need one more. I need these boys up here. <laughs> get up there, Luigi. I need this last Luigi to come with us. Oh, there's a hammer, bro. Do not take out one of my Luigi's. There's the pipe, and oh my lord. What is going on here? Everybody meet up. Oh my lord. No! Yeah, everybody down this way. This <laughs> still could be that. Right, we're just gonna take this way. Get up there. Anything up here? Nothing up here, okay. We're still looking for that third green star. I'm gonna head down this pipe. Will everybody come with me? They will. Okay, cool. And there, here's the third green star. So we need four people to actually get it. Luckily, we have five. And we all just hop onto this path right here. And we'll float us up. <laughs> now, does one of my guys need to get top of the five poles? Is that how it works? I got it. Cool. <laughs> I didn't know how it worked. I didn't know if like, all of them need to get top of the five pole. But just, just the front one when you're controlling them. Get top of the five pole. You get it. And then you get a bunch of bonus points for having more cherries. Which is dope. But there we go. 100% done. And now we can move on to the final level. What is the world? Let me get that cool stamp. My favorite one's Plessy, so just Plessy chilling in the water, hanging around. But I think we crushed this one easier than World 1. Like, we dominated this one. I thought this one was going to take us longer. But I, I do enjoy the next one. It is that ice world over there. Oh, it's a lot of fun. I am a fan of, like, ice and water stuff. 
Bowser's Bullet Bill Brigade. Say that five times fast. Bowser's Bullet Bill Brigade. <laughs> Bowser's Bullet Bill Brigade, baby. Okay, but this one is a yeah. I, I was gonna say it's a it's a moving one, so I have to collect everything in the in the time being. Because if I miss something, I cannot just like restart and speed run through it. It's gonna be a pain. So hopefully we can do this first try. Uh, what power ups are we in here? Give me some cool. We do get an extra fire fire, so it is fire fire level. Got all these bullet bills, man. I gotta make sure I'm just like ready for everything. I start taking these dudes out. Get them out of my face. But I gotta make sure I take out like all these blocks and make sure I get every single uh, thing in this game. Oh, we got this cannon. Oh, I'm, I, I think we need this. We can charge this up with Y. We can shoot things, which is pretty dope. I think it, I think pick up them. There we go. So there's more hats. Get another power up. And we go this way. There's stamp. I don't think there's a stamp for this level. It might not be. Oh, there's the first green star, hopefully. That firsty? No! I think I need that. That was first green star. Show me another cannon block. I really do need another cannon block. Show me another cannon block. I think I need that. I think I needed that throughout the level. That might be tough. We might have to backtrack for this one. We might have to backtrack for this one. I don't think we start now. Give me a cannon. I need another cannon block. And I think I think you need to survive throughout the whole level to get it. I'm gonna be upset. Unless there's one here. Show me one here. There's not. Can I get up here? There's a stamp. Okay, so let me get the stamp. Now we need one more green star. But again, I think we need a cannon block. I get it. Kind of stinks. Please, please tell me I get another cannon block. I don't think we can. No! Yeah, see, it was right behind this wall. We need a cannon block. That's whack. Do I restart? I think I'll come back later and grab it. I think I will come back later and grab it. And we come out here, and we got my boy Boom Boom. Do we have to fight Boom Boom before Bowser? Or how's that going? I mean, this is a little invincible thing. The best thing to do is actually just go to a wall. Even when he's invisible, and whenever he comes near you, just jump on the wall and slide. Come here. Just go with that. Bang. Yeah, whenever he's invisible, you just do this. Hop up on the wall, and just slide. It's pretty simple, pretty straightforward. You constantly do this, chances are you're not going to get hit. Well, get out your thing. Get out your shell. I'm coming for you. I missed him. Dang it. Come here. Bang, and it's... Was that the boss fight? Wait, do we have the first Bowser or no? I know we save a Pixie. That seems like it's the end. It does seem like it's the end. I guess Boom Boom was just a uh, guard in there. I guess he was just guarding there, but we still have to backtrack, so episode's not over just yet. We save our second fairy, pixie, whatever you want to call it. Episode is not over just yet. Hopefully we can get top of the flagpole. If not, we get another chance. I have to go back. Give me that. Top of the flagpole, baby. Top of the flagpole is pretty simple. And there we go. Finish up World 2. I am still going to be recording because I do want to show off getting that final green star. Be able to get that. But dude, that was my first green star I missed. And I said it in the beginning. I was like, we have to do everything perfectly. And of course, we lose our hat. Our little bomb hat. A nice little boom boom stamp. Yo, they got some awesome ones. I cannot wait to have it all filled out and just look at them all. But there we go. Second pixie save, so she can unlock me a wonderful little path. And man, yo, we don't got the green star on top of the flagpole. Yeah, I like that fairy. The gold on her? Looking tough. Looking real tough. Slap. Lock that. And we're gonna head right back inside this way. Let me back in here. Let me at him. Let me at him. So we're gonna have to fight Boom Boom again. That's totally fine. Not a big deal. But change characters? Nah, it's a Luigi episode. Next episode, we're rocking out with Toad. He's a speedrunner. We're able to skip this and we're able to get rolling here. Um, I don't think we really need a Fire Flower right here unless we really need it. I'm just gonna test out my jumping skills. Ah, we need a Fire Flower. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give me my Fire Flower. <laughs> and there should be another one up here, right? Might be able to get another one. Yeah, just start a inventory. I just gotta make sure I don't take hits. Just be very careful. Be super, super careful. Take out my boys there. A little spin. <laughs> I'm trying to think my favorite world. I think World 1 was better than this world. Okay, need this thing. I think things, let's do this one simple. I think World 1 was better than World 2. I feel like World 1's always better than World 2. I never really liked the same world. So I don't know why. I think World 3 is going to uh, blow everything else up apart. Right, so we gotta take out you guys. Hold down Y, make sure I snipe you guys. Make sure I just get all these boys out of here. Cause I'm not trying to lose this thing. Come on, you're chill on me. 
chill me, Fire Flower. There we go. Take out the Fire Flower. Now we should be pretty much chill because they, they did us work last time. We gotta watch out for these spikes right here. We'll jump up here at a certain time. Beautiful. Now we're chilling here. Go my Y held down. These guys are quite annoying. I'm gonna shoot that block down if I can. Be able to come down here, take them all out. One shot. There we go. Walk around this way. I'm not dealing with the spikes. Snipe these guys. They're all dead. And eee! I must just hit that spikes. I would have been very upset. I would have been very upset if that happened. I'm going to get the stamp again because I can. And actually kill these guys from there. Actually, I'm not even worried about the stamp. That bullet bill scaring me. Smoke all these guys. Oh my lord. Chill on me. Chill on me. Chill on me. Okay, take all you guys out. And I should just be able to get up here. And get the, get the third star. Beautiful. Let's break over this wall. There we go. Perfect. And now we finally 100% it. Uh, world 2. Unless we die to Boom Boom. But I'm pretty sure that's not going to be happening. We do have a cannon. Yo, can I shoot this boy? <laughs> can I just smoke him with the cannon? Oy. Oh my lord. Uh, I guess we'll just jump. Do a backflip. I jump. Can I smoke him while he's in turtle shell? No, he's like invincible with it. I wonder if we can KO him just by uh, doing all this. But what you're normally supposed to do is I'll show you guys up against Boom Boom. Oh, that actually does a lot of damage. As he turns invisible, I'll do it for the last hit. When he turns or when he spins, I'll show you exactly how you're supposed to defeat him. Like if you're uh, if you're not skilled to just jump on him while he's spinning. That's like shooting though. I want to see that. What you're supposed to do is actually just let him spin. I want to see if we can actually kill him with cannon. And when he spins, he'll actually spin out. Right? Or does he not do that anymore? Yeah, he'll spin himself out. And then he's just on the ground for a free hit. And bang, we hop on him. And we're chilling. Awesome, awesome, awesome. 100% World 2. We are chilling here. Great video today. We're rocking out. Tomorrow's videos, we're going to uh, record some more Pokemon. I got a few legendaries left to record with. And we're going to uh, be doing another Bowser's Fury episode. That game is a lot of fun. Or that little DLC. It really feels like uh, just a Mario Odyssey DLC. That's exactly what it feels. Just a whole other world. It really does. Well, this game is, is tons of fun to me, so I absolutely love it. It's just simple. It's relaxing. It's just a blast. It honestly is playing through every single level and having a lot to do. And, and such a big variety, too. That, that helps, like, the game, too. But there we go. Clear score. Done. Bang, World 2's done. I actually want to go slide through that pipe and check out World 3 before we actually do finish off today's video because I just want to give it a nice little sneak peek. And I got to make sure we did 100% this. Yeah, yo, we, we did perfect. We did real well. We did real well. And then we're to the next area, which is ice. And I forget what the area after this is. I really don't remember, but yo, this one's gorgeous. Yes, sir. This one does have a couple extra uh, levels, I believe. I believe it does. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. As in the next episode, we're going to be taking on World 3 and hopefully completing it in one video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.